Hello fellow stackers and collectors, it's your host Southern Stacker. I hope everyone's having a wonderful, wonderful Friday. I hope it was great. I hope you guys and gals have some plans for the weekend. So today, got another great, amazing, super wonderful video for y'all. I went to my coin shop again. Second time in one week. And I picked up some really, really cool coins. I don't have these in my collection. And remember, my collection, it's growing. Uh, I only have about 25 ounces of silver, so nothing crazy right now. But the plans are to acquire more. It was within my budget. I saw some stuff. I was like, you know what? It's Friday. I want to break the week up. I want to see if there's anything to kind of, again, break my week up, make this week not seem so dreary. You know, kick, kick Friday off with a good start. And I thought, what better way than to go to my local coin shop? So, this is what I got. Drum roll. That was a pretty bad drum, but... <laughs> I got these right here from my local coin shop. I don't have these in my collection. Let me break them out and show y'all. Got my little, my, my little ouncey bags. And I'll be breaking my for you. So I got some Barber halves. And remember um, what I just said. I, I don't have any of these in my collection. So a 1904 Barber half. See, I don't even know which way to, to turn it. Pretty slick. Very, very slick. But man, these things look awesome. 90% silver. U.S. Constitutional coin. 1906. This one's not as slick. The back is, but the front, the front looks pretty good. I mean, not I mean, not amazing, but you, you know what I mean compared to the other one. <laughs> so I got two of those. Got two of those. I've had these before in the past. I've had one, but I gave it away. I, yeah, it was a very very long time ago. But this is a standing liberty quarter quarter and if my phone would focus is a 1928 and i don't know where the mint marks are on these and it could, could it could be rubbed off so i'm not really sure maybe someone in the comments can tell me what the mints is that it down there right there i'm not sure it says m so there's that Another 1928. Wow, these look amazing in this light. Wow. Again, pretty slick, but I mean, not the worst 1928 for uh, Standing Liberty. I think it looks pretty good. So I got two of those. So two Standings and then two Barbers. And I got 15 Barber Doms. Now they're they're pretty slick. They are pretty slick, but there's a couple in here that don't look too bad. If you if you follow my my YouTube channel and you are, I, I post things every few days like a poll. Today I posted a video, and I saw not a video, a, a photo of pretend you're a PCGS grader. Pretend you're you are an employee of the company. What would you grade that coin? And if you want to see that, you can just go to the community tab on the, on this YouTube channel, and you can look at it and you can grade it yourself. We've had a few people comment. Some people are saying um, grade four, so or G four, which I would probably agree, if not lower. I think somebody said that. But man, I mean these aren't too bad. I mean they're not that slick. I think they look pretty good. Also, guys, guys, have y'all been keeping up with the? the gold going up and down I mean oh my gosh I mean it's been going down obviously more than up but I looked this morning and it was like 1800 and now I think I, it's kind of stopping at 1790 95 last time I saw like, that's insane I think that's the lowest that I've seen gold like in a, in a very very long time at least a few months granted I've only been looking at it for a few months <laughs> because I've been buying gold. If you guys uh, are not familiar, I bought this Lunar Tiger Series here. 
from the Perth Mint. Really beautiful gold coin. I have a video coming out tomorrow of my next gold purchase. So yeah, I'm not going to show you every single one of these, but yeah. Got some really cool um, Barber Dimes here. Really good deal. These would, I would, I would assume these would be Kohl's. But I got these for uh, about two ninety three dollars. We we negotiated on two ninety, um, so I, I got these for two ninety a piece, which I think is a pretty good deal. At least I I think so. I've never bought bar barber dimes before, but if you were worse to buy a roll of fifty coals from a AP Max, I want to say it was four dollars and forty five cents per per coal. I mean, theirs are probably a little better than mine but I mean for the price you know I think it's worth it I put it a little a little over for the standings but these have dates so that's the reason why I grabbed them there wasn't many to choose from and then on the barbers they're really she only had a couple and these were actually the best looking ones there she had some uh, peace dollars but I didn't grab any of those because I have one peace dollar already in my collection so if you watched my previous previous video, I um, added some more junk silver to the box. And as you all know, the box is pretty small. <laughs> it's, it's filling up very, very fast because um, this is only one month of silver buying. And honestly, guys and gals, I need a bigger box. So to commemorate the special occasion of buying more more silver for the stack. I, I I bought this. Okay, I bought this. It it was on sale. It was Hobby Lobby. Guys, gals, look at this masterpiece. This. This is a treasure chest. Worthy of holding U.S. constitutional junk silver. Okay, okay. There's nothing inside of it nothing at all let me move this out of the way in the back so i can get it all in the frame put that there okay great so boom there's nothing inside but there will be very soon so again if you watched my previous videos i got some morgans i got a couple of quarters this is all 90 percent constitutional silver so i'm gonna dump it in here it's gonna be kind of loud i'll try to be gentle wow that already looks so amazing okay i'm getting everything else up that i bought today try not to drop any on the floor oh and also guys gals if you if you don't know we're close to 2000 subscribers and if you subscribe you don't have to, but I would appreciate it. If you subscribe to the channel, um, you'll be entered into a, uh, a giveaway. Two Franklins or this Morgan. Just go to the video. I'll post it in the description. And just go to that video, comment Morgan or Benji, and you'll be entered into the giveaway. And I want to say you have 48 hours to do that. So if you haven't done that, do that immediately. Free silver to somebody eventually at some point so here we go our uh, purchases for the day what? oh my gosh guys gals look at the dent we have already made look at that dent we have already made we have only been stacking constitutional for one month if you could see me right now my, my hands are on my hips and I'm just kind of like wow this is crazy <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm I'm so excited. This silver stacking journey is it's been so much fun. I thank you everyone who have uh, been involved in the last few months on this channel. You know, encouraging me, you know, giving me advice, telling me what some of these coins are, and just etc. And etc. It's a lot of things I've learned just in the past few months from watching the community and hearing feedback from the community. And this, to me, is like a representation of that because I never would have thought about buying these or, you know, buying these, you know, for stacking purposes. I was honestly just buying the, the generic silver rounds 
you know, might buy the occasional eagle or the Canadian maple leaf. Like, I never even thought of buying junk silver in bulk like this. Never, ever would have thought. But anyway, uh, thank you guys and gals for watching the video. Tomorrow I am posting my um, gold challenge video, so I'm getting some gold tomorrow. Hopefully if the mail runs like it's supposed to, which sometimes it does not because it's really cold tomorrow. Hopefully the uh, roads don't ice over and they don't delay stuff. But stay tuned for that tomorrow. Again, if you want to be entered into the giveaway, uh, go to the, the, the description of this video and click the link. Go there and comment Benji or Morgan. And yeah, you can win some free silver. So uh, thanks. Hope you guys have a wonderful weekend coming up. And I will see y'all back here tomorrow. Peace. Y'all be good.